say from about the age of three to probably about the age of six or seven. It was glorious because you didn't know anything about any of the bad stuff in the world. Um, yeah, yeah, I think that was probably the most trouble-free, happiest time of my life because I was oblivious to the problems that exist in reality and that was just great. I think life was a lot simpler back then um, and as a child you um, just experience unbridled joy. You don't really worry about uh, anything at all. Uh, when you get into adolescence and in your 20s and 30s and so on, you can still have happiness, but um, fortunately, uh, society sometimes pulls you in different directions, uh, I think. Most of the time, I think pretty stable. I think like everybody else, I'm prone to um, let things get on top of me. There again, yeah, the way you say that, let things get on top of me, it's real victim mentality, that, isn't it? It's like the victim blaming themselves for being beaten or whatever. Um, how do I view my own mental health? I try to treat myself with more tolerance than other people treat me. And I try to treat myself with more understanding. I sometimes think I'm a lot harder on myself than other people are. I think uh, pretty at the moment. I think it's it's pretty good to be honest. I mean, it has been at times been pretty awful, but I think I've kind of got got used to um, my limitations in a way. So I kind of know when things aren't going in the right direction, and I can probably recognise recognize it more than I used to I think when I, when I was ill which I've been ill in the past with depression and anxiety and other things I kind of it was almost like I was racing headlong into some kind of disaster no one talk no one like speaks about it which is it's a bit of shame to speak about and you know all they can speak to is their is their doctor and and that's it but they can't speak to their friends and family about it, which, which, which it is, it, it can be difficult at times to tell people what you are, but you, people need a bit more to, 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 their, um, to be more open about it. I've, uh, when I was really struggled in the past, my mum and dad loved me, but um, because there were certain times, uh, you know, at a dining room table, I'd be, upset about something and I don't know if it's a generational thing but it's a, sometimes you know my mum would be like oh there's nothing wrong with you snap out of it you're fine you know you've got everything going for you all this all this kind of stuff and she's only saying that because she cares and loves me and then she feels exasperated because you know I, I'm more than capable 